To view or add new users to the system, head over to the Site Administration panel and click on Users. Under Accounts, click on Browse List of Users. This page will show us all of the users that are currently enrolled on our system. From here, we can click on a user's name to be taken to a profile page. This page will give you all of the necessary information about this user, including which courses they are enrolled into. Currently, this user is not enrolled into any courses. From here, you can click on the Edit Profile button to edit the user's profile information. You can also use this page to give the user a new password. To add a new user, head back to Site Admin, click on Users, and under Accounts, click Add a new user. You'll be given a form to fill out the user's information. The required information for any user is the first name, last name, and an email address. Users can be given a custom username or the username can be the same as their email address. Next, we have to allocate a password to the user. There are two ways of doing this. We can manually set a password for the user or we can have Moodle generate a password automatically and email it to the user. Let's fill out the rest of the user information and then click Create User. The rest of the user fields are completely optional. Users will be able to log into their individual profile and edit their profile fields later on. On the Browse List of Users page, we can also suspend a user account by clicking on the eye icon or completely delete the account by clicking on the bin icon. Notice that some users do not have any icons next to their name. This is because you cannot edit a user with higher level access than yourself. Also, you cannot delete or suspend your own account.